Hey. So the question is, do you think there's a symbolic value to the number four? And you reference four seasons, four elements, etc. And then some phrases that seem to be common in the English language that relate to four or um, a square, talk about a square deal, um, fair and square, etc. So, I mean, I think just, I would say there's some commonalities within our culture and our way of understanding um, space and time that bring four uh, back quite a lot. I, I don't know that I would say it has a symbolic value. Um, I do think that I would buy that more if we're talking solely about the phrase square, um, because I think that a square is balanced. Um, but the number of four, I think the only connection to that is that a square happens to have four sides. Um, as far as a fair deal being square, um, again, I was looking it up a little bit tonight and it looks like that um, kind of turn phrase um, became more prevalent in the 1500s when we're talking about um, winning something fair and square. That's the first time that historians can find that phrase being used. And that's kind of the thought process they had is that you want it fair and square because you did everything on the upright. You were completely level-headed about it or completely fair about it. Um, and no matter what angle you look at the, you know, the, the um, tactics that were used to achieve that goal, it was done in a very fair way. As far as the number four, I mean, I guess <clears throat> I've never thought about it before tonight, but I just can't seem to find a symbolism in it. I, I think you'd have a lot more buy-in with me if we were talking about the Trinity. Um, I mean, there are four directions. Um, space and time are infinite, um, so maybe it makes us feel like we have to always include all four directions because, in a way, the only way we can feel grounded is if we just consider ourselves as the center of existence and everything goes in four directions away from us. Um, I was thinking about that before I recorded this, and I only buy that for a little bit when I get really start to think about it there are so many different so many more directions that things can go than four right like in front of us and behind us um and then our family connections and the comple complexities of you know genetics and um ancestry it just doesn't seem to me to be um symbolic